Jake out loud. Okay, Jake, do your stuff. All right. Hi, this is Jake Lawrence. This is Jake Out Loud. And my guest, Mr. Shane Murphy, Montreal musician. Great to have you along. Thanks for you? coming by. Nice to be here. Thanks. Thanks yeah, for it's me. not the first time we've talked over the years. No. Uh, a few times. So I'm a couple interviews here and there. Yeah, it's always been a lot of fun. Uh, what we're going to do here is we're just going to chat. We're going to talk a lot about music. Let's give a little background for who you are. Uh, you've been in the Montreal music scene for over 20 years. Yeah. Right? Or longer by now? Yeah, I mean, I started playing uh, started playing bars when I was a kid, so yeah. Over How 20, old were you? 20, 20, 16, 17. So you weren't allowed in there. <laughs> Pardon me? You were. Uh, you are well, allowed. Well, not allowed. That's, performed, that's, uh, you know, that's a blurry... Uh, it is, it is. I can uh, I can't I can't recall whether or not we were allowed it at that time uh, the minors, but uh, well, yeah, when I worked at the Comedy Nest, we used to have every once in a while a young performer on a weekend. Yeah, uh, they'd be fifteen or sixteen. As long as they performed and there was an adult present, yeah, it was okay. So yeah, that's so okay. yeah, no, I was uh, I was a kid when I started playing. I started playing with my. Uh, my buddies from high school, you know, yeah. slide in here, open mic, yeah. uh, you know. Jam, open jam, whatever, and yeah. uh, I started playing bass with my uh, my cousin's band when I was seventeen. Okay. And then when I turned eighteen, I started gigging pretty much full time. So you started on bass guitar because you play really yeah. well. I started started guitar, but my my cousin, so I was the junior member of, yeah. of that band, so I got uh, I got it was a, a lateral move, right? Because right. bass is just as important as guitar. Oh, absolutely. And uh, yeah, so I got put on bass. Uh, let me just throw because. I was listening to interview. I am thirsty. Is it okay? This, uh, are these for us? Yes, absolutely. What is this one. here? Voss? This is Voss. It's, very, it's a very delicious looking bottle. Yeah. yeah. What is that? Sparkling. Let me try that here. Is that thirst quenching? That's one? delicious. <laughs> that is delicious. Sorry. Um... Just did a Pilates class, so I'm a little, a little tight. Oh, yeah. I, yeah, I, I am strange. I'm tight. into heat yoga. Yeah? Yeah. No, <laughs> no not at all. Um, I was listening to an old interview we did a while ago. Is it, uh, Station 10. Yeah. Do you go back that far? I do. I do, yeah. And I was just playing with... Uh, so my cousins, who are yeah. all from... Uh, grew up in the Point. I grew up in Verdun. <clears throat> okay, you grew up in Verdun. Right. Yeah. Uh, and uh, so... We play Station Ten all the time, yeah. And uh, it was one of my one of my first real because it was a show bar, yeah. And a lot of people played there. Um, I think my cousin booked my cousin Emmett who gave me my first guitar lesson. I've, I've spoken about him in a bunch of different interviews, and uh, yeah. So I did Station Ten a bunch of times. I used to live around the corner. From yeah, Station 10. I think Bar Diane or something, or it's changed. Color. Anyways, for me it was it was a, it was a big deal. You know? <laughs> I never met, uh, I think it was Casey who was the owner. No, I don't remember who it was. Yeah, some guy would talk like that, and everybody would do this imitation, and I yeah. never met the guy. Oh. Cause but I apparently he talked like that. So I was like, who's the, who, you know, who the hell is Casey? Yeah. I meet this guy. I almost started my comedy career there, because we used to go there with a cock and ball. Okay. Across the street, uh, just diagonally. and uh, The cock and ball. The cock and ball. <laughs> oh, the cock and ball, sorry. The cock and ball. I'm yeah. sorry. I apologize. Yeah. I miss you. Let's go there. That's well, a different type of club. That is. That is. Uh, back in the... I'll, I'll get to that a little bit later, but uh, they used to have open mic nights, as you know, and you could yep. sing, you could do poetry, really, eh? you could do comedy. It was on Monday nights. Did you ever do any poetry? Never. How, the, how do you think that went over? Uh, I don't know. We'll beat, we'll beat poetry. <laughs> Jake out loud. Subscribe. It's off. It's off. Jake out loud. Subscribe. <laughs>